Hey guys and welcome back to episode 25 of Be Then. Let's get straight into things. I feel bad in Cam. I mean, she has a plan. Ooh, that was interesting. I was, it was weird how I, I mean, last week when Venom was like, oh, I could kill Miss Rhea. Free Ren took it quite well because obviously they're talking about the clone. Yes, yes. But like right here as well, it looks like Free Ren kind of had a thought, a memory back to when she had a conversation with Sadie, it seems. And she just kind of smiled at that memory. I feel like there is going to be maybe a connection between just like how Ferdinand reacted um, and maybe what something that Sedi said because yeah she seems to be making like a bond kind of connection between the those memories and like the situation yeah I'm not too sure I do wonder why she smiled as she thought back to Sedi a fatal vulnerability Ooh. true we do know that Freedom is a slower caster than Ferdin who was that One of you made it this far. It came off to you very viciously. Mm, he's gone up against Replica, so this information will be quite handy. Merely imitate the functions of the mind without actually having one. And who created them? I mean, it would have freelance weaknesses. It's good to see you too. Glad you guys made it out. Wait, so did you guys go... Ah, oh, so that's why she's aware of the monster. Yeah, I'm surprised you guys didn't team up. Aww. Yeah, fair, fair. After our fight. Personal grudges. <laughs> Sorry, old man. An apology within an insult. Oh, uh, so that's why it placed the strongest replica. I'll free them right in front of its gate. Wait, so can, can't we distract the free rent? Oh, uh, but okay, never mind. Of course, it's got a ceiling spell. <laughs> Of course you did it free then. God damn it. God damn your replica. <laughs> At the risk of your life. And of course you know that spell. Okay, never mind. So we have to defeat the caster before we can open the door. I was thinking we could distract it and like break through. Why the rush? Sure. Oh. Yeah, I was worried for a second when she mentioned her brother because they said that there were no survivors at the tomb. Exactly, yeah. I mean, Ferran does know fully them best. Ferran? <laughs> I know you were testing things out. Her casting speed is insane. What, what, what was I meant to notice though? Is it now? She stops the taxi mana for a brief moment. Really now? Oh, Frida. But you could have helped us with this exam. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Freelian's the type to have that 
vulnerability, but it's hard to exploit it because all our other areas are so like strongly covered. But this time they do have a lot of members, so her not being able to detect how did you guys end up like this again? <laughs> but yeah, being they might be able to with their sheer numbers. Yo, yeah, you're surprisingly really enjoying then coming up with a way to defeat your replica. Today is an off day for high, high day. Your face is blue. How much did you drink to the point that it's blue and there's a bloody humongous monster? Who drinks in the dungeons? <laughs> Heiser? Heiser? <laughs> oh, this lad. Right. So you do admit you are the dungeon boss. <laughs> Brianna has missed the like human interactions, the relationships. Are we doing this? What's the plan? Yeah, but you've never had to clear the dungeon with you in it, though. Oh, wait, you two are going in it alone. Oh. But most of us will probably die. Shit. <gasps> They're all here. Oh, no. That does make sense. It's better than having a, like it all become too chaotic that they can't deal with it. And this this is the scene from the opening where they walk in. You guys got this. The boss music has begun. I love how they're so obviously in sync. Jeez, what spell is this? We haven't seen a spell this. Cool, we don't dodge, we obliterate. How frightening I can be. Them two in the background, I can't. Yeah, I feel like you're gonna have to. Reflexively, okay. Right! Like, in short, Bedin's grown up with this spell. It's like a common spell for her, whereas for Freeran, it's a new spell she's picked up on, so she has to kind of think about how to use it. And we know that Sada already is a quick caster. Ooh, we're finally here with Sadi. Yeah, how did... What happened after your first interactions? Why have you come to see me? Flummy. I can see how you perceive humans in your relations. Right. Oh, so magic being this allowed um, was quite recent. So that's how you had come in connection to the magic association. Uh, okay. You didn't sound too happy, but I can't comply with this final request. You don't want that. Okay. I mean, I'm not surprised. Sadie does have that kind of elitism. <laughs> it looks like let me knew you quite well. They're both elves, but they perceive things very differently, don't they? It's, it's fascinating. 
Crazy field of flowers. That's a beautiful spell. I, it provides something else. It's not offensive, it's not defensive, but it's kind of something for the heart. It's just magical. It's just like magic should be. Okay. Thanks, Eddie. <laughs> Little Flammy is so cute. Yeah, I guess because our time spans are shorter. I wish I could ignore all my problems for a millennia. <laughs> The humans will overtake us. Interesting, this is the scene that she remembers. At the start of the episode, I said it was interesting how she kind of looked back to this memory. Or me? Or a human ma or a human maid. Okay, now I get why she looks back at this memory. So that's why Freddy and Anne was looking forward to this. Okay, this is a good cut. <gasps> that's why she was so proud. Don't tell me this is the end of the episode. Oh god damn, no it is not alright! <laughs> okay, that said though, overall I do like how they really like weaved in every aspect of this story because I was wondering how they were going to kind of tell us the story of, you know, Bedan finally defeating Free Ryan. Yes, once again, I know it's a replica, but pretty much it's a perfect replica. So it was indeed about Free Ryan kind of defeating her master, but it was more than that because it looks like they actually had a conversation, Sedi and Free Ryan, about how well, since humans have a shorter lifespan, they tend to like, you know, try to achieve things more quickly or well, they're forced to achieve those things more quickly because our lifespans are shorter. So that is different to Free Ryan, who has like accumulated over these years these skills but as said he said, you know, elves can just like ignore their problems for a year, a few hundreds, a millennium. But humans don't have that luxury. So that's why Eddie actually already predicted that the only things that will defeat you is either A, the demon lord, or the B, a human mage. And that human mage being Bedin. And I do say that with a smile because it's like kind of meaningful what humans have achieved. I think that was the main kind of purpose of why we also saw like Free Ryan enjoying all of them kind of like put their heads together to come up with a plan in defeating her because that's what she used to do with like Haita, Aizen and him all. Well not Haita because he was drunk, wasted. I don't know if that's like a good way of dealing with your problems or like the worst way to deal with your problems. Haita just be like drunk in the middle of that mess, like absolutely hungover. Because yeah, we can see within another kind of short scene during this episode, Free Ryan looking fondly at Himmel, you know, defeating what looked like to be a demon on their own. Like they have been able to achieve that. Humans have been able to achieve that power and develop to this extent on their own. And that's why she was happy with this whole situation. That's why she was proud to see that Fedon is indeed that human mage that is able to defeat her. So yeah, overall, I really like how they went about this episode. But yeah, I guess now with Free Ren, the dungeon boss defeater, we have to now go defeat the actual like dungeon your boss but they said that it doesn't really have any threat to itself except for like it's replicating abilities and i guess that concludes the second test so yeah i guess with that makes you guys that awesome and i'll definitely catch you guys next week